Hello, you all. You already know what we about to get into. We about to get into these messages and see what our Elohim would like us to know at this time. We finna get into these messages and see what our Elohim would like us to know at this time. We have the Queen of Wands to the Five of Pentacles. And the Two of Swords. With the Hangman. So there could be um, somebody that is losing their job. Somebody is um getting fired from a job here. This person was in denial about being at a loss for doing sacrifices. This person been doing sacrifices and this person was in denial that they would lose anything or that anything would happen to them by them sitting up there doing sacrifices and shit. So this person about to get fired. We got the strength and the, uh, and the eight of pentacles. This person was doing sacrifices to strengthen their money. To receive money, to receive blessings, to have abundance, ten of pentacles, to be happy, to even have riches too. So this person was sacrificing other people to have these things in their life. This person could be an Aries, Leo, Sag, Pisces, um, Virgo. Capricorn, Taurus, Cancer, or Scorpio. This person was doing all of these things. To have happiness. <laughs> so they was trying to sacrifice other people to have happiness. To even have a man who go this King of Wands. They could have been taking the risk right with their ass. They had somebody invested in them doing this shit. They could have been dating this person. And, every, and that's why within the dating, it was always arguments and chaos and shit and confrontation because they let the devil in when they was doing these sacrifices together. These motherfuckers let the devil in. These people was doing this over a long period of time, too, with the uh, Knight of Pentacles to get their wishes and dreams fulfilled. Nine of Cups. Magic. The Magician. With the Hermit. These lovers was doing this together. And y'all was seen doing everything y'all was doing, greedy motherfuckers. Page of Swords, Four of Pentacles. Y'all was seen doing everything that y'all was doing spiritually. All that damn magic. All them damn sacrifices. Everything that y'all did, now y'all about to be at a loss. If this person don't lose a job, you're going to lose your health or somebody going to leave your ass. Because you shouldn't have been doing all that damn uh, magic and sorcery just to have shit. And it ain't even, it ain't, it's one thing you doing, <laughs> for real, for real, it's one thing you doing some type of magic so that you can have happiness or wealth, but you motherfuckers decided, y'all was in denial, you, you thought that by making sacrifices that you wasn't gonna have to answer to that shit, that's the crazy part, you thought that you wasn't gonna have to, you trying to sacrifice other motherfucking people and sacrifice other things in people's lives just so you can 
other. Live good, bitch, please. Just so y'all asses can live good. That ain't how that shit work. That's some fucked up shit. And y'all was living it up too, shit, hell. Ten of Pentacles, nine of Pentacles. Y'all could have got riches off this shit. If y'all ain't rich, y'all, y'all doing all right. This knowledge is going to be shared with the community about y'all with this higher font coming out. Most high sharing that knowledge about what the hell y'all ass been doing and that communication coming through. Mm hmm. That communication coming through by a healer. It could be a Taurus, a Pisces, a Cancer, a Scorpio, an Aquarius. That communication coming through about y'all ass. Mm-hmm. And they got the skill. It could be a Sag, too. A Sag could be saying something. An Aquarius, a Pisces, a Cancer, a Scorpio, or a Taurus. That shit coming through about y'all ass. And they skill. Skill healers. Healers with skills. And then somebody could even be very popular and shit. The world gonna know. The world gonna know what y'all ass has been up to. Because y'all ain't got no business doing that shit to people. What the hell? Fucking everybody else over just so you can live good and shit. And then greedy. <laughs> y'all was greedy. You already doing well and living good, then you got greedy. You got motherfucking greedy, and now that shit about to fuck. <laughs> that shit about to fuck y'all up. But somebody could be upset or mad or whatever the case may be, because we're going to see what's going on. Somebody noticed that somebody cut them off. <laughs> if these people ain't in no relationship, these people could be lovers or some shit. Somebody noticed that somebody cut their ass off. Somebody, oh. This woman could have got left for real. She a certified hoe. Yeah, this woman got left for doing this shit. This man was in on it too, but he just like, shit, fuck this. <laughs> this some fuck shit right at the top of the deck. This, this man feel like, man, I ain't finna go down for no hoe. <laughs> he said, fuck this shit. I ain't lying. And then you mad because somebody been stepping on your neck and they won't let up. But you, you play dummy games, you win a dummy life. You're mad because somebody hot and you not. You got to do all of this manipulation and fucking sacrificing and shit to even be hot. That don't make you motherfucking hot or having it. Look what you did to get it. You mad You mad because somebody always know when you're lying and when you're doing shit. You could be mad because this person refused to chase you because you get passed around. You also mad because somebody's vagina is good. You also mad because somebody, you could have been somebody's friend or something and they like, fuck a friend, what are those? No message is the fucking message. You mad about a lot. And let me find out you were trying to sacrifice your friend for some shit. This, you mad because you can't figure this person out. You can't figure something out. They're a selective introvert. They're selective about who they let in their energy. And you don't meet the criteria. And I see why. Because you be doing sacrifices. You be doing magic. You be doing manipulation. Just to have shit. 
the fuck? You mad because this person makes shit look effortless. And you really mad. How you know they pussy wet and good? You mad about they wet, good vagina? How you know? Bottom of the deck, my calculations determine they big mad. You is big mad. How you know about this person? Uh, How you know? <laughs> how you know about this person's vagina, man? How you know about this person's vagina, man? You, you, you try to block other people's money? Y'all be doing the most. See, y'all try to... Y'all not only sacrifice people, y'all try to sacrifice things in other people's lives. Y'all be trying to block people money and shit. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Who got a loan to do money blocks? You got a loan to pay for some shit or do some shit, ho? Oh. Oh. You need your ass kicked. This motherfucker got a loan. <laughs> this motherfucker got a loan to block somebody and sacrifice they ass. Oh, you, you, woo. Oh, hell no. <laughs> Unnecessary spending. <laughs> Man. This person signed the fucking contract. Sign that damn contract. This person felt like they deserved more. So shit. <laughs> they got a motherfucking loan to do some bullshit. Instead of getting off their ass and getting shit done. That shit in reverse. <laughs> Being smart with your money, that shit in reverse. Oh, you going out sad, man. Ain't no way. Yeah, this person was financially taking advantage of somebody else. And then this person was trying to steal somebody else's ideas and put their hands in the, in the cookie jar. So somebody could have told you about the things that they wanted to do and you tried to grunt and go do them. Wrong path. You thought you was going to be in for a sweet surprise with doing this to somebody. No, you're not. And you tried to curse their career. You just thought it was a golden opportunity, huh? That's why them investments ain't work out. And you don't have no skills to create. This situation is all bad for you. This shit about to blow up in your face. And this was teamwork. This shit about to blow up in your face, ho. This was te a team effort, y'all got. <laughs> ain't no fucking way you did not get alone to do some bullshit. <laughs> oh man baby no my babies why do y'all got that much hate <laughs> in y'all hearts why do y'all be hating so bad I wish the fuck I no, let me not say I wish the fuck I <laughs> hell no <laughs> that shit crazy you did not go get a motherfucking loan honey who the hell is these people <laughs> now I gotta see what y'all signs is with all of the signs that I know y'all can have them signed somewhere in y'all chart but I'm about to find out what y'all sun sign is cause this shit crazy you did some raggedy shit and then you didn't even have no, no judge about yourself. You did it to a friend of yours, too. And look, I just split the deck because I'm, you know, I'm about to show y'all. Look, so y'all don't think I'm just, the deck is split. But I'm about to show y'all this lineup right here because this was meant for me to see this real quick. Look at this shit. Somebody, when I, I was just talking about the friend when I split this motherfucking back. The friend could not even care that she was doing what she was doing. It is what it is. They did what they did. You could have been mad trying to say this person was broke, busted, and disgusted. 
You mad because they don't want no new friends or they don't want to be your friend? You mad because you got caught, they caught your ass doing this shit? You mad because they got options in life? And you mad, you wake up mad and you go to sleep mad there. You was a mad bitch. <laughs> you mad as fuck. But hold up real quick. We got to see who y'all is. Because I know your ass didn't go get no motherfucking long to try to destroy <laughs> What the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> that had popped up before, but it's like, damn, not again. <laughs> What's that? Oh, man. Oh, man. Not again. <laughs> Hold on. Back to back. You could have been doing something back. Listen to Drake back to back. Oh, man. Oh, man. Not again. Not again. (laughs) I'm going to pull the Grateful Heart messages, and then we're going to find out the signs, y'all. Motherfucker took out a loan. Honey, what the fuck wrong with you? (laughs) <sighs> Ain't no telling how many people these people did this shit to, too. Like, that shit, wow. Alright. Who this woman? Is this woman an actual um, fire sign with the Queen of Wands energy? Okay, this woman is an actual fire sign. What are they? Are they a a, a Sag? No. Leo? No. A Aries. Double confirmation. So this woman is an Aries. Who is this man? Is this man an actual fire sign? No, because he did show up as the king of wands. They was definitely some karmic lovers. He not a, a fire sign. Is he a, a earth sign? A air sign? No, a water sign. What is he? Um, uh, Pisces? No. Cancer? No. A Scorpio. So this is a, a, a Aries female and a, and a Scorpio masculine. But it's always something to be grateful for because <laughs> this whole going out sad than a motherfucker. And whatever they did, they ain't getting away with it. That's some <laughs> the loan. <laughs> I just can't get over <laughs> I can't get over the loan. Is there anything else we need to know about this while I read these paper? No. So we have here, this is the day Yahweh has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. Yahweh is good and his love endures forever. Yahshua is not only a remedy for your weariness and trouble, but he will give you a, an abundance of the contrary, joy and delight. Great is Yahweh. He is most worthy of praise. Yahweh is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? Yahweh is a stronghold of my life. Whom shall I be afraid? As we express our gratitude, we must never forget that the highest form of appreciation is not to utter the words, but to live by them. 
Thank you for making me so wonderfully complex. Your workmanship is marvelous. How well I know it. O oh, my strength to you, I sing praises for you, O oh, Yahweh, are my refuge. The Yahweh who shows me unfailing love. Gratitude to Yahweh makes even a temporal blessing a taste of heaven. In his hands are the depths of the earth and the mountain peaks belong to him. Be still and know that I am Yahweh. So you ain't even got to do nothing to these motherfuckers. And it ain't, it ain't just, oh, let me just see. Mm. I'm about to see who all they was doing this shit to. Because <laughs> it's multiple people. It's a friend. It could be somebody that this person want to be friends with, but they could be a selective introvert. Whether it's the masculine or the feminine, you know what I'm saying? Um, we have Sagittarius, Virgo. A Gemini, a Taurus, they also did some shit too. Who else was these people messing with or have messed with? A Pisces, anybody else these people was messing with, doing dumb shit. Ooh, a Scorpio, so they could have been messing with another Scorpio or hell. <laughs> Scorpio, why you was teaming up with this person? They ass could have been doing something to you, or because you left a raggedy ass, they ass been doing something to you. So you in a bunch too. <laughs> Anybody else? Or it could be another Scorpio. <laughs> Anybody else? <laughs> I guess that's it. Honorable mention Libra. They could possibly have been doing something to a Libra. They did something to a Sag, Virgo, Taurus, Gemini, Pisces, Scorpio. But y'all ain't got to worry about nothing because these, these, these two motherfuckers, they finna get got. Especially that damn woman. She finna get sick or, you know, get left, be isolated. Lose her job and some damn money since you want to mess with other people. But I hope you all got a message from this read that'll help you along your journey. Know that Yahweh loves you. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you all later. Peace.